Hey, welcome to the video. In this video, we are going to see how we can connect MySQL database and Power BI and how we can build the visualization directly by using database data. So, to build the connection between MySQL and Power BI, we need to get the connector detail and we have to connect the Power BI by giving some credential. So, let's see how we can do that. So, to connect the MySQL database I go to here and I will click for the option of more option then here I have the option of MySQL database so I will click on here then press connect after that it will ask for some server detail and database so I strictly go to my MySQL workbench so here I have the three connection so I will right click on this one and click on edit connection so here we have the address like host name and i will copy this and i will go to my power bi here i will put that host name semicolon i will put 3306 that is my this one so port name 3306 my database is my local system so it will give the host name and port name so after that i will use one of my database so by the name of pb i have one database inside my system so i will click ok then it will search for this connection and it will connect that directly to the mysql database so so here we got that database and i will select this one so in this database i have only one table so it gives the option to select this table so if i load click on load then i successfully built the collection so it is loading the data after once it loads we can use that data for our visualization purpose we can do everything here so here i can see my data is connected so if i go to table view i can see the entire data here so here we can see all the data so i will just go to my this one uh, my sql workbench and i will open this connection so i'll put my password sorry And I will open this connection so here I can see search for that PB database so here I can see that PB database and if I search for the table so same table I have connected so here we can see that all the data is here it is connected now to my power BI same data is replicated here so now onwards I can use this data to build power BI report and I can do whatever I want I can show all the trends all the uh, sales of this data whatever data is presented I can present in a beautiful manner I can create dashboard so if I build this template once and you can save this template each time I refresh this the whatever data is updated here if I update data like here it will get refreshed here also so this is the use of connecting directly to the database each time we are refreshed the data get updated in template also so this is how we can do some connection between power bi and mysql database so just for the sake of i will build one report like one chart so i selected this one and i will select the country name so and enter then i'll select the country name next i have unit sold so i'll click on this and select that let's see i will click on this and put it over here then the country name here so here i have the report of country by unit sold so it is automatically get summed so this is how we can create the visualization directly by connecting to the mysql database so so this is about this video stay tuned for the next video next we are going to 
create some visualization in power bi so stay tuned let's learn about some basic tags and how to create some columns measures what is the difference between measures and column how we can connect the different database how we can connect between the tables and build the visualization how to visualize data the filter filter of the data the level of filter here we have three levels of filter like uh, visual level and page level and entire uh, template level filter filters we have so let's learn in the next video so stay tuned for that and thank you for watching thank you